How are you doing? Hi. I'm doing great. How are you? Doing great. Wonderful. Before you on our forums? Yes. Mm -hmm. What do you think about the new convention center? This is awesome. Okay, so the room, you go into it, and it's got two doors to the bathroom, and there's this That's whole That's the most city. important part, is the two doors to the bathroom. It, it's because, you know, that way I don't wake my roommate up in the middle of the night when... Oh, oh, you're you know. talking about the actual embassy suite Oh, yeah. Well, oh, room. okay, all right. Also, the, the center is really nice. The lighting is good. The classrooms are a lot better because I can see there's much better lighting than there's been. Um, so, yeah, this I, is... I, I mentioned yesterday that... Um, and, and this is going to get so old. The people who are watching are going to be like, uh -oh. we heard this joke twice yesterday. We don't want to hear it again. It's okay. There's no crickets in the lights this year. No, there aren't. Oh, my God. I, you had to bring that up. You really, you, oh. It Never awful, look up. Was, yeah, uh, not here. It's not like D&D. &D. Don't look up. Not here. Not here. Okay, yeah. Not at, not at the embassy. At the last place. Yeah. This place, no crickets. We're good. I know. Right? I yeah. haven't seen a single cricket. It's been awesome. And it's cricket season. Is Did it? Did you know that? There's a season in Texas of crickets. You can hunt crickets. Really? No. Um, okay. You know, I, I mean, I'm going to take North you Carolina? seriously. We do have crickets in North okay. Carolina. We have cicadas too. It's cicada year, actually, we so call it's them really locusts loud. In Texas. Locusts. Okay, fair enough. Even though a locust yeah. is a kind it's of like a grasshopper. Every seven years or something like that. Yeah. So let's get back to Reaper. Sorry. <laughs> you asked hey, I want to do something real quick. I want to. <laughs> I want to. I want to pimp something. Uh oh. Uh, even though you're not wearing your ReaperCon shirt. I'm sorry. Shame. I. I'm I wearing. Have failed. I'm wearing one of our cool Zazzle Ooh, yeah. Reaper concerts. This is Club Trog designed by Ooh, Jason Weedy. Yeah, Dreadmere and Yeah, Dreadmere That's Underground. Really nice. What kind of music do you think they play at the Club Trog? Mm, techno? Maybe metal? Metal? Could be metal. Could be. Could be metal. Could be metal? Yeah. You can get this on Zazzle. That's really awesome. Yeah. Yeah. You can get not only this, you can get the Green Griffin shirt I was wearing yesterday. You can get mm -hmm. your. Can you get the Pizza Dungeon shirt? Because I pizza totally need dungeon. one of those. I have one for you. Uh, really? Just for you. I have one just for you. Yes. Extra large? Yes, definitely. Um, Pajamas. Right. So <laughs> you can get these on Zazzle.com slash Reaper mm -hmm. Mini. Is that mm -hmm. right? You yes. You don't know. You have no I'm idea. I'm going to nod and smile with just anything you good, say. Good, good. That's the way we like it. <laughs> Isn't that what I'm supposed to do? Yeah. Just kind of just, just <laughs> yep, whatever you say, Ron. Rock okay. On. So let's ask some questions. Sure, sure. So again, sorry, people in live stream land. We, we're going to ask kind of the same questions to every artist, but hopefully they're going to get us brilliantly different answers every time. You'll get this Probably. cornucopia of different answers. <laughs> okay, so how did you get involved in miniature painting? Ooh, okay, so I was an art major. I was actually a pottery major, so I threw pots for most of college, and then what I met- What were you gonna do for a living? Uh, pottery. So I, went, I wasn't potterist, actually gonna pot, go, I just liked ceramics. There's, there's something very soothing about clay, and it. It, it's very zen, but no, actually, what I had wanted to like do at the time. Like when you kind of do the. Yeah, it's never like that now. I know. <laughs> actually, the worst. Well, okay, I won't digress. That's but not digress. To, it, the worst part of pottery is when you're centering that clay. I get a tremor if I have caffeine, and uh. so I had to give up my soda for my first year of college. So no, you need it, that. <laughs> it was you awful. Need that. But I realized pretty on I don't you know, I don't have a tremor otherwise. Like, you know, my hands yeah, stay pretty, pretty steady. steady yeah. But if I get too much caffeine, for some reason that clay is so much more sensitive I can't center it the way I want to if I've got caffeine. So when you said the worst part uh, about it, I thought you were gonna say the worst part of the about the movie Ghost. The oh, worst. oh. Uh, What's the worst part about that movie? Oh well, dude, like that death scene at the end. I don't oh, I, God almighty, it was freaky. Ugh. I yeah. Don't, I don't remember. Oh, okay. You my didn't have you watches. seen Ghost? Yeah, I've seen okay. it once. Right, my right. wife made me watch it. Yeah, She's it's one of those Patrick movies you have to watch, guy, yeah. Guess, so. Yeah, but so back to ReaperCon. Back to ReaperCon. So, yeah, I got into miniature painting because uh, I played D&D &D with the boys, and I was an art major, which meant I ne knew something about color and sure. painting. And they said, oh, good, we have these little figures. You should paint them. And I said, okay. Okay. And that was how I did it. And so for, you know, probably about for college and then, you know, grad school and everything else, I would paint. And then I took a break for a while. And then one of the guys from gaming said there's this reaper kickstarter in 2012 you know you can get these little miniature figure ca you know cases if nothing else and they have paint maybe you'd like that and i said there's like a side of this hobby where people talk to each other yeah uh -huh. oh instead of just gosh. hiding in the closet painting your little it was yeah so i painted by myself forever and then i found people who who taught me how to paint so much better what was your first reaper con um 2000 and 14. Was that the, uh, the that was the first was, year at the um, hotel, or yes. the second year at the hotel? The first year at the hotel. I think it was the first year. Okay. Yes. Yeah. yeah. It was 2014. I couldn't make 2013 because really? of work. Yeah. Yeah. So the first one, the first Reapercon was the one at the at the Hilton at the in Hilton. Louisville, Texas. Mm -hmm, okay. Mm -hmm. yep. Yeah. Which was nice, but the rooms aren't as good as they are here, so just. Stay. Yeah, it, that, that was a very nice hotel. The it Hilton, was. those people at the mm -hmm. Hilton were super nice. They were. Um, they really were. They, we just, they were very patient. We just patient. outgrew the facility. We just outgrew mm -hmm. it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. 
Uh, so you haven't been doing this that long then. Uh, I Thank you. You're so sweet. I really you, appreciate I mean, that. So, if you, so how long you been I doing? I started it? painting in '95. Okay. Yeah. So, so you're but I took like... a very long break for school. So oh, okay. yeah, I took probably about all told. Um, so for for med school, I did not paint for at least two or three. Yeah, probably about three of those years. Um, and then I had one year of grad school that I might have painted. Maybe a little bit, but not really. Mm -hmm. And then four years. So there was at least eight years in there that I didn't paint at all. And so mm -hmm. how's, how do you find time to paint with your busy professional life? You're a, I do nothing she's else. She's a doctor. I, that's yay. So um, Dr. Get your Cor shot. Dr. Corpore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, Especially for a gamer. Do, how do you juggle between finding all of your free time to, to paint and then, like I said, still be a professional? Uh, how do you find the time? Um, I, I make time. You know, I will. I, and the nice thing is, my job for the most part, even if I'm ca on call, I get to go home for a call. So when I'm on ER call, I don't tend to paint because I don't want the pager to go off and, you know, ruin my eyeball sure, sure, or yeah, something uh -huh. like that. Um, but I've still got a decent amount of free time. I have done a lot less yard work since I picked up painting. Mm -hmm, good, good. So um, your yard is a mess. My cats are okay on their own. They don't really need any love. And I don't have kids, so that makes it a lot easier. Mm, that'll spare, so that'll free up a lot of time. So I can pretty much kids. do it. It's, it's, it. Finding enough time to also play the video games is hard. What do you play? Yeah. Um, so let's see. I have finally finished Skyrim, um, which was oh. really awesome, the uh, special edition. Right now I'm playing Assassin's Creed Origin, which is really a beautiful game. I mean, the art in yeah. that is yeah, fantastic. Very pretty, very pretty. Yeah. What platform? Uh, Xbox. So really? Play for, yeah, I play on console. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have some PC games, but mostly I do console. And I play a lot of Diablo. Um, Love Diablo. Yeah, this has been a really good season for me. I finally got 100% on all of the conquests. I have not done that for any of the other seasons yet. So I started playing yes. Diablo 3, and I got it's most really of the fun. way through. It was, I was just, I love mm -hmm. it, I love it. Um, you get to kill things, it's great. Yeah, it's awesome. It's just a, it's just a mindless, just click, 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 mm -hmm. click kill. Mm -hmm. And it was, it was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. But that has nothing to do with what Sorry, back saying. to miniature no, painting. Crap, no, I, about, I'm really This is about you. Yeah. This is all about you. Oh, okay, yay. So whatever you want to talk about. Uh, well, let's look at the questions that our producer oh, has given us. Okay, all right, I got it. Um, Can I read them? Oh, that'll be the last question. Okay. We'll ask that last. <laughs> um, let's see. We got that. We got that. Mm -hmm. This is not a question. I'll just ask anyway. So uh -oh. you've entered, obviously, several Reaper cons. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, and done quite well. Thank you. Thank you. Um, what you guys have been nice to me. Yes, yes. Well, you've been great to us. Thank you. Um, help promote the hobby. That's great. So, it's fun. Yeah. How many, what other national competitions or, or you know, regional competitions have you entered? I do you enter, do you enter local painting contests or you just, it's not fair? You just blow those guys away? No, I, I think I entered one in Greensboro once back in, and that was maybe 2012 or 2013, and that was fun. That was just local at. Um, and you destroyed the competition. You destroyed them, didn't you? Yeah, so you I can say no. It hurt, but it hurt my feelings. Modesty. I didn't want to. No, just... seriously, dude. Um, I went to World Expo last year. Oh yeah, um, and that was really cool. I do not get to like Adepticon or Gen Con. I live not far from Dragon Con, but Atlanta. And the fact that the hotels, the, all five of them, sell out within ten minutes, yeah. scare the heck out of me. Yeah. So yeah, I really haven't. And finding the vacation time—that's that's the big thing Tough for work—is finding the vacation time. So I really don't go to any of the other competitions. Or so how'd you do like it at uh, World Expo? Yeah, I got bronze. It was got good. Bronze? It was okay. good. Yep, yep. And and tough the nice thing is, it's tough a very tough competition. They gave me bronze for my whole collection, which did make me feel really, really awesome. So that was because it's a little bit different. They'll actually judge whole um, oh, whole sections as yeah. opposed to pitch, uh, one, picking one, one miniature. Um, I know here for competitions, that's what we do. We pick what we think the best one is, and Your we all judge that. Go mm -hmm. for that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So you've done quite so well good. with all these things. So, yeah, good. so, um, so one of the things we typically wrap up with mm -hmm. is. What faction are you supporting at ReaperCon? Oh, Dusk Wardens. Yeah? The only awesome fa Well, okay, all right, that's not true. They're all awesome, but the most awesomest. So, yeah. It's Dusk Warden. Can you, can you name the other factions? Yes, there is Maggot Crown. Uh, we got rid of Bonehenge, right? They died yeah, off. We killed yeah. them off. Good, yep. good, good job. Got rid of those guys. Um, we've got the River Widows. Um, Blood Wolves? Is it Blood Wolves? Uh -huh. Blood Wolves. Is that it? Are there only four? There's four. Okay, so that's it. And then the uh, Dusk Wardens, right? Yeah, so yeah. that's all of them. All right. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So, and we got rid of, like I said, we got rid of Cthon. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The that was guys. a really cool miniature. And from the Bonehenge Covenant. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. So we got rid of all those guys. Yeah. Cool. So okay. They so, might be back. You never know. Yeah. You never know. Mm -hmm. You know, Joseph Wolf's running all those games. So. He is. Yeah. Yeah. So. Well, all right. So again. You know, thanks for stopping by. Thanks. For coming Thank to Reaper and supporting the MSB Open contest. Awesome. Thank you. And next, we're gonna have another special guest. We're not gonna tell you who it is. It's just another special guest. I don't feel like telling you. So let's just. Let it be He's a surprise. He's trouble, man. What the I heck? Know.